Hey everyone, how's it going? My name is Zan Piarley here with Terry Hutchins Advanced Sports Writing Class. We're going to break down Indiana basketball's 98-65 exhibition victory over Hope College the other night. A lot of positives to take away for Indiana in the first exhibition game of the season, the first time they're playing against another opponent. Uh, a lot of live scrimmages for the team and Hoosier hysteria, haunted hall of hoops, but nevertheless, another opponent coming in and challenging them. It's got to feel good for this team, you know, seeing an outside opponent. So let's get let's get right to it. Um, OG Ananobi was as good as advertised. I know he's top of the draft boards, or should be at least coming out of the Big Ten. Him and Thomas Bryant. Um, but looking at his performance uh, on the night, it looks like he added a new element to his game. Four or seven shooting from three point land. He took as many three pointers as Robert Johnson did in the in the game. So really. A fantastic job from OG. He was out on the court shooting five, you know, at 5 o'clock, two hours before game time. He was the only one out there working with student managers, working his butt off. Uh, Coach Crean said that he's he's been in the gym. He's, he's a guy that's been in the gym more than anyone else he's seen at his age. And if he keeps doing that, he'll be in a very good place in the future. So high hopes for OG. And on the defensive end for him as well, he doesn't skip a beat. He had an incredible block that he's been sent back about 25 feet on a poor Hope College player. And then even though the ball didn't go out of bounds, they regained possession. On that same on that same possession, he ended up with a steal and then a fast break. Thomas Bryant with the finish. So OG is looking good, as good as advertised. As we, and even handling the ball too. He can handle the ball. We don't know who's going to handle the ball for this team. Coach Crean said maybe it's going to be you know eight or nine different guys. Who knows who handles the ball? Maybe Thomas Bryant has to handle the ball. But it was interesting because he started Jawan Morgan at point guard tonight. He said earlier in the week, Crean said earlier in the week that he wasn't seeing you know the leadership that he wanted from his point guard uh, from the from the guard play. Doesn't didn't really know who was going to bring it up after losing Yogi Ferrell last year. Morgan started at point. He made the simple plays, didn't make any mistakes. But then even after Morgan came out of the game, Josh Newkirk, the transfer from Pitt, he hasn't played a game in two years, came in and it was a more traditional lineup with Newkirk and then Johnson and Blackman at the guards and then Ananobi and Thomas Bryant down on the blocks. And Newkirk played exceptionally well. He missed his only shot attempt of the game. It was a three. But other than that, he uh, had seven assists on the game. Looked very strong with his play. You know, he was great on defense. A lot, of, you know, very ten tenacious. A lot of uh, forcing turnovers and was quick on his feet. And then, with that being said, the other guard played. We might see James Blackman bring up the ball. You might see Robert Johnson bring up the ball. Both guys coming off I injuries, surgeries from all from the off season. Blackman had the knee surgery, of course, forced him to miss all Big Ten play in the rest of the season. Johnson got injured at the end of the year, had ankle surgery in the off season. They both looked very strong on the night. Johnson struggled shooting a little bit at the, in the first half, but no, nonetheless, when Johnson was out on the court, Indiana outscored Hope by 44, so that's positive news for him. And looking at Blackman, people are concerned about his defense. His defense looked very good. He was up pressuring the ball a whole lot and you know, taking it the other way. He got, grabbed a rebound, took it the other way on uh, full court and made a layup. But looking at him, he's good. And another guard that could possibly get into the mix is Devontae Green. The other night, 17 points a game high for the Hoosiers in the exhibition victory over Hope. Um, he was 7-9 shooting. He looked great from three-point land. He's really He made a few moves that were just jaw-dropping. So a lot of positives coming out for Indiana in this Hope victory. Um, we, they'll face Bellarmine now on Saturday. So for Terry Hutchins Sports Class, I'm Zampiarly. We'll see you later.